The halter is a useful piece of cattle restraining equipment, especially when the head bale on its own is inadequate. Start with a long piece of rope and something fairly thick. You certainly wouldn't want to have anything thinner than the rope shown in this video. To start with, take the end of the rope and tie a good loop in it. Feed the loop over the cow and look how this cow reacts. You certainly need to keep your hands clear. Pass the middle section of the rope through the loop. This will create another loop, so you've created an effect of figure 8, and it will be the second loop that makes the nose band. Pass this nose band over the cow's head, not only keeping your hands clear, but minding your head. Head to head contact with a cow is never a happy experience. Pull the rope tight, and bring the head of the cow around to one side. If necessary, you can wrap the rope around a pole to help brace the head and keep it still. Your finished halter should look something like the one in the photo, however it may be necessary to swivel the whole thing around so it's actually under the jaw of the cow rather than off to one side. This of course depends a little bit on the temperament of the cow. If it's not safe to do so, so long as the rope is not in the cow's eye, then it'll be fine. To remove the halter, take up the slack in your free hand, take a hold of the nose band and pull it off the cow's nose gently. When you pull the tail, the nose band will slip back through the loop which will now just be resting over the cow. Let me demonstrate that again for you. The rope is passed behind the cow's head. The loop is passed under the cow's jaw. The middle section of the rope is passed back through the loop to create the nose band which is then passed over the nose of the cow. It may be necessary, as is in this case, to move the knot so it's further under the jaw of the cow, the rope in this case is now rested against the cow's eye, which isn't the desired effect at all. Pull the cow's head around to finish restraint.